Hello everyone, this is the Tetramix, the smaller version of the Pyramix. As you can see, there are no corners. The corners are not there. I mean, these are the corners, but actually they are not pointing out like the the Pyramix. It's the same as the Pyramix, so you need no need to worry if you have already learned how to solve the Pyramix. And it's really simple to solve this cube. You no need to worry about it. I'm I'll be going to teach you now. So first what you need to do is you need to know that these three will be the edge pieces and these three will be the corner pieces. You take this as the base. So first what you need to do is you put these three edge pieces and after putting this you will be able to see these two pieces will be in the correct place, these two will be in the correct place and these two will be correct place. But this might not be aligned. It might be like this or like this. So what you need to do is with this you need to form the radioactive symbol and bring it in the correct place. That's like this. The green three pieces will be there. Then once you get the radioactive symbol in your base, 110%, the top will be already be aligned for you. Then the next you'll put the edge pieces in the base. And uh, after putting the corner pieces, you'll be solving the first layer, and this will be the second layer. As you can see, is the clip version. My Tetramix is the clip version. It's quite hard to turn. It's quite heavy. So let's get started. And hear the clipping sounds. But it works really nice. Okay. There we go. So let us take if uh, we have two pieces already there like we'll take this part so we'll consider this as a blue where we need to get the blue color over here so we have got already two blue color pieces over here and we need to get the third one so what you need to do is search for it first and uh, yeah it's right over here so if you just turn the top like this there we go we have got the blue corner piece sorry edge piece and uh, this is a situation when you get the uh, two pieces like this which are in the bottom and one this piece which must be over here so what you need to do is if it is like this also if we have two pieces and we are searching for the third one we got it over here and now we need to put it over he here so we, it forms a radioactive symbol so what you need to do is you can see these two pieces we need to get it correctly above like this the piece like this over here so we turn the back part and there we go with the blue color and with that we should catch the left and the right there we go we form the radioactive symbol now as you can see this is this this is now going to be a base and now yellow yellow red red green green I told you we should be it should be paired and uh, now it's not bad actually so we need to just turn the top one two and three there we go now we have got all the reactor symbols in the perfect place now we need to solve the first layer this will be the base which will be our first layer and uh, now we need to remember that each and every piece which must go over here here and here must be on the top like on this top layer okay so we'll be solving the blue and here will be a green and blue piece so we'll search for the green and blue piece ah it's right over here so when we are going to do that we need to remember the blue the base is blue in color so the blue color this piece is the green and blue and this must go over here so we need to remember that the green is facing us and the blue is in the bottom and the piece the blue is the main color so the blue must be facing us by keeping it on the right uh, since blue is facing us it's on the right right side so this is the algorithm which we start with the right it goes down down up up you can see we have got the first corner piece and as you can see we have displaced the reactor symbol so we can just get it back that's it it's not a problem if you just move the radioactive symbols 
Now we go for the second one, which is the blue and yellow corner piece. And there we go. Here is the blue and yellow corner piece. Blue is the base color. Yellow is over here. And blue is now facing us. It's on the right. So we start with the right. Down. Down. Up. Up. That's it. Now we have again displaced this. So we connect it back. That's it. We go for the next one, which is the red and blue. Now, as you can see, this piece is flipped. So what we need to do is we do the same algorithm no matter which from where we are starting so we start again with the right side so we get this piece over here which is an unknown piece we get it over here so we go like this right down left down right up left up now we have got the red and blue piece on the top and we have got, got to get this piece over here blue is the base it's facing us red is facing us and blue needs to go over here so it's on the right we start with the right down down up up oh as you can see we have solved it now this is the uh, scenario number one and there will be lot many uh, confusions which you will be having so I will show be you the first scenario uh, and this is the first scenario as you can see uh, we have solved the first layer and uh, now we need to solve the corner pieces on the top and now in this scenario you must you need to look for a piece which is completely not solved uh, for example, you can see this piece, the yellow is solved but the green isn't. The red is solved but the yellow isn't. But over here, the green isn't solved and the red is not solved either. So we were looking for this piece. Now, this is a red and green uh, edge piece. And now we are going to look for a piece uh, which will be the green and uh, which will be where this piece must go. And uh, this piece must go right over here. Since uh, red is facing us, we need to make now the red as the base. Now this red and green must go over here. The red, green is the secondary color. Red is the base. This piece must go over here. So what we need to go, uh, do is, uh, the it's since it's on the left, we start with the red left, down, down, up, up. Now we go back to our original base, which will be the blue, like this. And we need to find the piece, yeah, it's over here, the green and uh, blue piece, it must go right over here. It is the same thing with the left, down, down, up, and up. That's it, now we have solved this tetramix. There we go. This is the second scenario, in which you'll be seeing, uh, actually you should have solved the first layer. And then comes the top one, in which you, sh you know, there, there'll be... None of the pieces will be solved and uh, each will be in the wrong place. Now in this situation, what we need to do is you can choose any piece uh, like this one, this one, any, any piece you can choose. I choose this one and you need to do down, right down, left down, right up, left up. We do that, right, right down, left down, right up, left up. Now this piece, now it's since uh, we, uh, it's on the right the piece which came up we need to turn the cube like it's on our uh, left hand is on the left we need to turn the cube on this base and do the same thing right down left down right up left up. now the yellow and blue piece as you can see we need to put over here yellow is the base color it's facing us it's on the left so left down right down left up right up and uh, by doing this we get this situation in which we actually uh, we got this before and like this will be paired up but the red isn't and the yellow is paired up but the green isn't and here's the unpaired piece so is the yellow and red and the yellow and red is over here so we need to as ye uh, yellow is facing us we need to take yellow as the base like this and put this piece down over here so it's on the left we start with the left left down right down left up right up and now since that blue is the uh, first base color we need to go back to blue turn the cube blue and red blue is the base color is facing us secondary color red is also facing us so the left so we put it on the left one two and up up and there we go we solve the tetramix this is the last scenario in this you should have solved the base and uh, in this scenario you will be seeing that one piece will be solved 
and these two pieces will be not fall and they will merely flipped like this you can see the yellow and red red and yellow green and red red and green so what you need to do is you can choose any one of those no matter so you choose i choose the right one so we go with the right one right down left down right up left up now this blue piece was the base color so we no need to look at this this is not the color which is on the base and is the yellow and red and yellow and red is over here so since yellow is facing us we keep the red as the base now and the yellow must be going down over here yellow is the base color now and the secondary color red is facing us and red is on the right and sorry left and since the piece is on the left we start with the left down down up up now i think you should have learned how to solve the tetramix it's really easy really really easy and uh, it's my method is the easiest method to solve the tetramix we have solved the tetramix please watch all the uh, uh, scenarios so that you get clear and you have no doubts and subscribe to my channel to get the latest updates on how to solve amazing cubes thanks for watching